woman found her mouth and eyes were sewn up with stitches when she woke up. She tried to scream for help, but she couldn't make a sound. Anna couldn't stop trembling with fear. She didn't know what was in store for her. In her instinctive desire to survive, Anna got out of bed without thinking about the problems. She climbed the stairs step by step with her memory of the house. At the same time, Anna desperately tried to remember what she had experienced last night. But her mind was blank. It was as if the memory had been lost. Anna faltered in panic and crawled to the door. As she walked out of the room, she accidentally knocked over the picture frame on the wall. But since she couldn't see anything, Anna didn't take the frame seriously. Then she cautiously held the stairs and walked downstairs step by step. She didn't know that a sharp piece of glass was standing in her path on the stairs. Anna stepped on the shard of glass while her eyes were stitched shut. The pain on the bottom of her foot instantly made her fall to the stairs. Her mouth and nose were sealed with stitches, making it impossible for her to make a sound. But in order to survive, Anna could only endure the pain in her feet and move her body down step by step. She managed to reach the stairs only to find the door locked. Just when Anna was desperate, she suddenly remembered that she had a key in her bag. So she hurriedly turned around and held the wall to get the bag. But Anna accidentally knocked her bag onto the floor. The key fell out with it. Anxiously, Anna leaned down and felt around for the key on the floor. But the key played hide and seek with her as if it had eyes. The key brushed her hand several times. Just then, a pair of long legs in black stockings suddenly appeared in front of her. Anna groped for a pair of legs and grabbed them like a lifeline. However, the next words made her fall into the ice. Is my sewing okay? Mom, Anna never thought that it was her daughter who was sewing her eyes and mouth shut. She was so scared that she stepped back, but her daughter grabbed her by the hair. Then she injected an unknown liquid into her body. It's night time. The girl is cooking in the kitchen. She prepares a nice dinner and sits like a good wife waiting for her father to return from work. Sam entered the house and saw how quiet it was and asked his daughter what was going on. Instead, he heard his daughter say, Mom won't bother us anymore tonight. Sam didn't notice anything unusual, but turned around to change his clothes. But he had just taken the steps when he felt his foot stepped on something. The father picked up the object and found that it was a syringe with a trace of blood on it. This is the end of the film. Some people say that the girl did this because she has Electra complex. She treated her mother so cruelly in order to possess her father completely. Others say that the girl is mentally ill and has a severe split personality. So she doesn't know anything about all these things. But what I want to say is, in terms of the girl's behavior, can reflect a family education problem. What a child can become is determined by her personality and behavior. A child's character is shaped by her experiences and environment from childhood. Parents play an important role in a child's development. A girl's family relationships shape her character and thus influence the course of her life. The question of what parents want their children to be or how they want them to live their lives can be seen in your behavior to a large extent. I hope that every parent can find the right way to raise their children and give them a happy life.